And now, it's time for everyone's favorite dating game, Mom's Soulmates! With your host, Guy Lasney! Oh, stop it, please. Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Console Mates, a show where we aim to match a poor, lonely gamer with a console of their dreams. First, let's meet our eligible consoles. Representing the Nintendo Switch is none other than the Jumpman himself, it's Mario. Since my princess is in another castle, I'm down to play around. Guess it's a good thing the Mushroom Kingdom doesn't get basic cable, otherwise you'd be in some real hot lava there, Mario. <laughs> yeah. Moving on to console two, representing the Xbox series, whatever, it's Master Chief. Well, guy, I, uh, I'm just really excited to be here, you know. Things, uh, things haven't been going great for me lately, so I uh, could really use a win here. Uh, you know, Chief, normally we try to keep things light and playful here. Maybe you could try doing a, a funny pun, something about how you're looking for a new local co-op partner or something. <laughs> we just cut local co-op. <laughs> okay, well, hopefully console number three can turn the mood around. Representing the PlayStation 5, it's Nathan Drake. They say there's no honor amongst thieves, but I'd be honored to steal your heart tonight. Ooh. Did it just get hot in here, or is it him? Uh, my armor is actually climate controlled, so I don't really feel changes in ambient temperature. I don't... love you. And on that note, let's meet our eligible gamer. Hailing from the majestic duplexes of Burbank, California, it's Lana! Thanks, Guy. I'm so excited to be here. I've been looking for a new console to get into, but I just can't seem to find the right one for me. Well, you've come to the right place, Lana. It's time to find your... Console Okay, consoles. I'm a gamer who's always on the go. Between commuting to work and socializing with friends and just not wanting to be in Burbank, I'm out of the house a lot. What do you have that will fit with my fast-paced lifestyle? Well, if it's portability you want, then uh, you've come to the right place, lady. See, I'll give you a console quality experience wherever you want to go. And then uh, when you're ready to slow things down a little bit, we can curl up on the couch and I'll dock right in. Oh, wow. <laughs> so feature rich. Okay, console number two. Well, uh... I would prefer you to play me on the couch, if you know what I mean, but uh, hey, if you, if you don't want to do that, that's okay, I, I can live with that. You, you can always play my games on a laptop, or uh, stream them on your phone with my Game Pass. Just please, please play my games. Okay, console number three? Portability, pfft, please. I've tried that noise before, it wasn't for me. See, my games are premium experiences that command your full attention. Trust me. You're going to want to be sitting down when I blow your mind. Ooh, the confident type, huh? I like that. <laughs> <sighs> me too. Uh, <clears throat> but uh, we're not here for me. Uh, Lana, why don't you ask another question? Okay, consoles, I'm not trying to come off as shallow, but when it comes to gaming systems, looks do matter. <laughs> so, tell me what you got in terms of graphics. Hey, oh, you know, graphics are on everything, toots. If anything, it's the art style that stands the test of time. Sometimes 720p is all you need, baby. Ooh, sounds like someone has some trouble getting it up to 60 FPS. <laughs> okay, um, console number two. Well, if graphics are what you're looking for, Lana, then you've come to the right place. My console's got so many teraflops, you're gonna be like, oh, damn, that... There's a lot of teraflops. Okay, uh, and what's a teraflop? Oh, well, I, <clears throat> it's, a, it's this thing that, uh, that makes the graphics more good or -er. You, uh, you don't know what a teraflop is, do you? No. Yeah, I thought so. Console number three? Well, doll, I don't know how many teraflopies or whatever my console has. I just know my games look good. Real good. Never thought I'd be jealous of a toothpick, but here we are. Anywho, Lana, we've got time for one final question. Better make it a good one. 
Okay, consoles, with inflation and cost of living continually on the rise, I've got to be more frugal with my hobbies. So what you got for a gamer on a budget? <sighs> Mamma mia, let me tell you, if your wallet's tight, look no further than my console. I got great deals on new games, classics, indies. I got something for everybody. The adults love me, the kids love me. I, I mean, not, not, not in that way, of course. I mean, uh, 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 sorry, what was I saying? I get it, you're the complete package. Emphasis on Beckage. Charming. Console number two? Well, hey, I, I've got a ton to offer a gamer on a budget. If my big old console's too much, uh, that's okay. I got a smaller console that's cheaper. And if that's too expensive, then that ain't no problem. You don't even need to buy a console. Just get my Game Pass. Just please, please play my games. I'm so lonely. Okay, console number three. Listen, honey, just because you're sweet doesn't mean I'm going to sugarcoat it for you. I'm not cheap. I'm the best. So, if you want the best, you're going to have to pay for it. And if you want the best and you don't live in America, you're going to have to pay a little bit more. Well, I sure know which one I'd pick, but we're not here for me. We're here for you, Lana. You've heard from all the consoles, so now it's time to make your choice. Okay. I choose... Console number two! Yes! Yes! Can't believe it, but you chose Xbox! So, Lana, walk us through your thinking here. Console number one, you seem really great, but kind of unfocused and not really what I'm looking for. I have a kid brother, though. Maybe I'll send him your way? Well, I do love kids. Not like that, though! And console number three. You seem really cool and all, but also kind of like you're so used to winning that you've become an arrogant jerk. Yeah, well, PS5s are still sold out everywhere, so it's not like I'm gonna lose any sleep. See, that's exactly the attitude I'm talking about. You guys see the new God War Ragnarok trailer? Pretty sick, right? And console number two. You come off as really needy. Honestly, downright desperate. But you know what? I kind of dig it. I like a console that's made some mistakes in the past and is now working extra hard to do right by its gamers. And that's why Xbox is the console for me. Yeah! And don't you worry, Lana. The days of Xbox recording you 24-7 with a Kinect camera are way behind us. Wait, what? Well, that's our show, folks. Lana, here you go. Have fun with that. Thank you all so much for watching, and we'll see you next time on... Hey everyone, thanks for watching. We want to thank the Lord of the Rings Rise to War for sponsoring this video. Rise to War is an epic strategy sim game set in the expansive world of Middle-earth. Take control of classic characters from the Lord of the Rings saga such as Legolas, Aragorn, Gandalf, and Sauron as you command any of the eight mighty factions as you fight for control of territory across Middle-earth with the ultimate goal of claiming the One Ring. And just like Frodo Baggins, you don't have to go at it alone. Create and join fellowships with other players to pool your resources and gain the upper hand against your opponents. And while you don't have to be a diehard Tolkien fan to enjoy this game, it's positively chock full of references and love for the Lord of the Rings saga, making it a real treat for fans of the franchise. There's never been a better time to get started in the Lord of the Rings Rise to War, so use our link in the description or the QR code on screen to download the game. And as an added bonus, you'll receive a special Hobbit's Adventure Package for free. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye!